Hello friends, welcome back to Creative Exploration with Purs. Today I want to talk about the Flux Pro 1.1 Ultra and RAW models that you can access using BFL, Black Forest Labs, API key. There's a really cool wrapper by Shmuel Ronin. It is, allows you to use the Black Forest Labs API key to access the Flux 1.1 Pro and Ultra models, as well as the optional RAW mode that they use to make the images look more like actual photos. This is a really great option if you don't have a really powerful GPU and uh, or like any GPU or a Mac or anything where take, making images takes way too long. So yeah, you basically just set it up and it's this very simple two node setup here and uh, you can bang out images. So let's get started. So you just want to go to the manager in Comfy UI. So click up here and then in custom nodes manager, you want to install the Flux Ultra. It's right here. Comfy UI Flux 1.1 Ultra and raw node. So just go ahead and install that. And uh, once it's installed, you'll find in your Comfy folder. So if you navigate to your Comfy UI folder into your custom nodes folder, the folder will be in here. The Comfy UI Flux 1.1 raw API. You're going to want to open this config.in file and paste in the API key that you get from BFL. So in order to set that up, in the description below you'll find another link for the Black Forest Labs API page. It's api.bfl.ml. Uh, you're going to want to sign in, register, and then put a few dollars in there, five, ten dollars, whatever, into the API system and then add an API key. I had to actually add two API keys because it was showing my password instead of the API key. So if you find this string is not long enough, it's probably because it's doing the same thing. So just add a second key. Uh, it's free to add keys. It's all good. And just name it whatever you like. And then when you're ready, you just hit show on the API key and it will, uh, or copy, and it'll copy the API key into your clipboard. And then after that, you want to open that config.ini file. So navigate to your comfy folder, go into the custom nodes folder, and you want to go into that comfy UI flux 1.1 raw API folder and open up that config.ini file. And you're going to see this API X key and base URL. Uh, it might have two equal signs. You're, wanna get, you're gonna want to get rid of the one equal sign so that it's just one equal sign, and then paste your API key in here. I've hidden mine, obviously, because you know then you could use it. Paste that in, save it, restart Comfy UI. So then just go back to Comfy after you've saved that and restarted Comfy, and you want to add the Flux Pro 1.1 Ultra and Raw node, and then pull image out and let go, and you want to add a save image. Um, I've just put mine in the flux ultra slash ultra folder so that it makes files called ultra. Uh, and then we're going to say, you know, like a beautiful sunset in the Swiss Alps and then just run the queue. Ultra mode is the upscaler for the high res images. Uh, it's six cents an image to do ultra mode and four cents an image to do without ultra mode. The aspect ratio you can select. Um, safety tolerance, I believe, is how much of the NSFW filter it tries to apply. So higher the number, the more value, lower the value, the less it tries. Uh, output format, you can select between PNG and JPEG. And raw mode tries to make it look like a, like a real photo from like a phone or a, a camera. So you can turn that on or off depending on what you're looking for. And as you can see, we get a beautiful image. Um, so this is a great way to explore the uh, Flux Pro Ultra and RAW models and still give yourself access to all the fun post-processing tools that we have in Comfy. So if you have a potato or a Mac or anything like that, um, this is a really great way to make images on your computer. All right. Have a great day.